Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at Alexander Isaac in the Wonder Kid Watch. Uh, a very good player for Real Sociedad who's performed very well in real life for them this season. Banging in goals for fun. Um, certainly a player to that I'm interested to take a look at. He's a big guy, six foot three, playing that striker role, but can also look to develop a bit wider as well. Um, good bit of pace about him and lovely bit of dribbling and first touch and finishing. So certainly a player that I think can grow in those roles as well. And a bit of flair, which is always nice to see. 12 caps already for Sweden and four goals. Uh, we can see that he's already wanted by Arsenal, which could be an interesting signing for them. Um, signed originally by Dortmund from AIK for seven and a half million pounds. Uh, and then moved on to Real San Sebastian, Real Sociedad, um, in the Spanish divisions for an undisclosed fee. So he's already moved around a little bit in his career, but 20 years old, still got plenty of time to go. Uh, very Looks very well-rounded with regards to his stats other than his defending, which isn't something to worry about. But we'll jump ahead, see where he's at and how his career has progressed so far. So it looks like he's stuck around, developed a bit more in playing those wider roles when needed, but... Looks very good with his dribbling first touch. Acceleration and physicals have all increased. Now 25, really in his prime now. Um, off the ball and flair and techniques all looking very, very good. Looks like his his ratio for Real Sociedad is nearly one goal every two games, which is a phenomenal record um, in Spain. And 62 appearances and 39 goals for Sweden isn't bad either. So a very good player. I'm surprised no one has come in for him um, and managed to sign him off from them. Looks a fantastic player. 14 goals in 32 appearances in the first year, 20 in 37, 17 in 35, 19 in 33, and 22 in 38 are all fantastic results and already smashing this season um, with an 8.4 rating uh, and a goal and assist in the first two games. So it's it's great stuff really for them. Um, if Sociedad can keep hold of him, it would be interesting to see how they do. Has he won anything? It looks like he has um, the Spanish Cup and Spanish Super Cup with um, Sociedad. So it's he's obviously helping drive them forward with winning a couple of competitions. So he, he's obviously happy enough there. But interesting to see if uh, any teams do come in for him, if there is any movement in the market and he joins anyone of the biggest boys um, we know that are out there. Wow, okay, so he's still at Sociedad. 106 appearances, hitting that century mark with Sweden. But... And 81 goals is absolutely incredible. He's slightly dropped off with his goal tally for Sociedad in 186 goals for 376 appearances, but still fantastic stuff. Physicals are looking very good for a 30-year-old. Has dropped off slightly with a couple of his um, technical stats, but nothing too much to worry about on that front. But still banging in goals, um, hitting that 15 tally every, at least every season. Looking very, very good. I'm still surprised that no one's come in for him. They have won the um, Euro Cup uh, as well, as well as the First Division. Wow! So Sociedad have actually just won the Spanish First Division, beating Real Madrid and Barcelona. No wonder he's happy to stay. They've just got into the Champions League. They've broken the duct of um, Atletico, Real Madrid and Barca's kind of run. Um Wow, okay, that's interesting to see, certainly. They've definitely um, showed their quality to him, and he's obviously more than happy to stick around with that sort of result. So, fair play on that front. It'll be interesting to see if he does still stick around, if he's, he's able to kind of stick with Sociedad throughout the rest of his career, or if that does change at all, but we'll, we'll take a take a look. Well, okay, it looks like Alexander Isaac has retired. He's a non-playable player, um, so it looks like he's left football completely. But what a career it looks like he's had um, at San Sebastian. We'll have to take a look and if he, see if he did go anywhere else or if it is kind of his ended career there as well. 572 appearances for them with 278 goals and a 7.56 rating. Uh, some impressive, impressive stuff. He's... Definitely easily hit over the um, goals and assists, uh, one every two kind of target that we thought he might get at the beginning um, after seeing the first five five or so years. Uh, but let's take a look and see if he did move on at all, or if it is a case that he's he just retired and and had a, had enough. Um, so we'll jump back a few seasons. I because I think he's just retired um, at the club and not 
no longer has moved on at all or anything like that. So it looks like it might have been the case. So let's take a, a quick look at the uh, released players. So you can see going through here. Da, 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 da. Did I just miss him? Yeah, I did. There you go. Oh, so he was released on a free. It might be in a case that he may have moved on to a different club. Um, or maybe it's just a case that he got to 2033 and he decided, oh, no, I've left Red Sociedad. Don't want to move on to anywhere else. Um, and I'm kind of happy to kind of put put an end to his career. But what a career that was. Very impressed that he stayed at that one club. And um, Real Sociedad getting some trophies in that period as well. Um, let's see... Did, it, did they win any more? So, no, that was their only um, Spanish Premier Division. It looks like they did win the Euro Cup and the European Super Cup as well. So, there are a few more trophies in there that he, he possibly could have won. Uh, but, fantastic thing to see. And he's sticking at that club. So, a, a player that we didn't really get to see move around much. But, one that's definitely worthwhile. If they can take Real Sociedad to the the top of the title as well as the Champions League certainly one to keep an eye out for but um, I hope you did enjoy it I certainly did it was a very good one today um, if you did like this um, like subscribe and all that good stuff and I will catch you next time goodbye